गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल आई वेलकम यू इन ई वी एस ऑनलाइन क्लास सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू द बुक एक्सरसाइज ऑफ लेसन नंबर ट्वेल्व एंड द नेम ऑफ अ लेसन इज आवर हाउसेस राइट इन लास्ट वीडियो we have done a b and c part and i hope you all have complete your work in your evs notebook e part answer the answer the following questions okay answer the following so question number 4 question number 4 describe any two special type of houses okay so answer the two special types of houses are first one is igloo and second one is the state house okay state house not house is house so first one we will explain about the igloo we will write four points about the igloo first point these houses are known as snow house s should be small okay snow house okay second one they have a dome shaped roof third they are found in cold countries and fourth point is your eskimos live in igloos okay so this is your four points about the igloo okay now we will write about the second house that is your state house second is your state house it should be small so state house first point they are made of long pieces of wood okay second is they 
are raised above the ground they are raised above the ground on the piles next third point they not they these these houses are mostly these houses are built where flood is common okay so these are the three points of your stilt house first they are made of long pieces of wood second they are raised above the ground on the piles third these houses are built where the flood is common so this is your fourth answer now the last question fifth one question number 5 what are w should touch the three lines what are the characteristics of a good house so what do you think what are the characteristics of a good house so we will write four point for this first one answer the this will come from the question itself the characteristics of a good house are first one a good house should be it should be small okay should be clean saaf hona chahiye safe सुरक्षित होना चाहिए एरी एंड कंफर्टेबल कंफर्टेबल ओके सेकेंड एट शुड हैव sufficient supply of air may air should be your house should be airy that fresh air should come into your rooms through the windows and doors it should have it should have a good drainage system and the fourth um good house should have 
should have separate room s is small over here okay separate room for eating sleeping studying cooking and taking bath so a good house good house should be clean safe airy and comfortable it should have sufficient supply of air it should have a good drainage system a good house should have separate room for eating sleeping studying cooking and taking bath okay and last one fifth one five points is sufficient okay it door and windows it doors and windows should have verb wire mesh so that mosquitoes should not enter the house okay now we will do now the activity on page number 77 okay so rearrange the arrange the alphabets to find names of different different kinds of houses different kinds of houses here they have written the jumble words and you have to arrange it okay so first one is your g l o i o so after arranging what it will come i g L O O igloo B O A U O H E S B T so what is answer H O U S E house B O A T house boat okay C A R V A C A N answer is C A R A V A N karma Okay now 
d1 i am writing over here d h t u is very simple h u t hut e e t n t very simple t e n t f o f t r so very simple f o r t so these are the five points in your activity and that's all for the day your lesson is complete complete this work in your notebook and send me the pic and your syllabus is complete and now you learn side by side okay thank you and have a nice day